Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Jai Makali. Time is the most valuable thing in this world. If there is time, there is life. The time of your life which has gone, has gone forever. The time which has just gone by will never come back. And if you all haven't done something meaningful, the loss is entirely yours. Every morning when you wake up, God gives you 86,400 seconds. You can't borrow time from anyone. You can't take a loan out against someone else's. The time you have is the time you have and that is that. It can't be accumulated. No clock in this world is going to slow down for you. No amount of money is going to extend your life by a second. Remember, one day there will be no time left. Your cliche which you were so fond of. If you remember that cliche, I have no time will become a reality one day. So, don't kill your time behind that television. Turn off that television and turn on your life. Don't kill your time behind that gossip, that mobile phone, those social media platforms, that non-productive activity. Don't kill your time behind being upset, complaining. Don't kill your time behind holding grudges, being disappointed, etc, etc, etc. It is impossible to tell life. Please carry over my wasted time today to the next day or add it to the remaining time of my life. What is possible? Make every second of your life count. Let's get active in life. No more procrastination. Become fearless. Take life head on. Fill yourself with conviction. No hesitancy whatsoever. Take decisions immediately. No dilly darling. Fill yourself with happiness and laughter and surround yourself with true people. Use your time intelligently. Spend your time with people who think you are an asset to them, who value your presence. Your time can be fully utilized if you be with people who fill you with joy, hope, happiness and love. This precious time has been given to you for a greater purpose, to achieve your goals in life. We have to utilize time to become great in life. First, we have to discover our purpose of life. The purpose of your life would be that work which you will be known for and remembered for much after you have left this world. The goal which you want to achieve is within you. Your heart is going to help you discover that objective for which you were given this precious thing, this priceless thing called time. If you give all your fleeting time behind that one goal, you are going to achieve greatness in that particular field. The best way to utilize your time perfectly would be to complete your work now, not postpone them for tomorrow. Thus, what is important to us is now. This moment which is passing, the future depends on how your Today is utilized. Imaginations have no meaning in this real world. They just disappear once they escape the mind. You have to act upon your action plans now to give results in the future. Therefore, success depends on how the present time is utilized. Thus, now and today are very important. Let me tell you all a story about the value of time. One day a businessman, after earning six million dollars, decided to rest one day. As soon as he decided to take a day off from work and was checking that bank account which had that six million dollars, an angel of death came to him and told him that the businessman's time was over and he should be ready to face death now. 
being a businessman, he tried negotiating with the angel and told the angel of death that he was willing to give the angel all the six million dollars. All the six million dollars he had in his bank account and in turn the businessman man wanted a few days extra in his life. But the angel didn't budge. The businessman pleaded in front of the angel to give him at least one hour so that he could say goodbye to his family and friends whom he hadn't seen for a long time as he was busy. The businessman bargained further and told the angel along with the six million dollars I would also give you all the real estate I have. But the angel refused again. Finally, the businessman asked if the angel could give him at least a minute so that he could write the final note. The angel granted his wish and he wrote a note which said, Spend your time judiciously. My millions could not even buy me an extra hour of life. During my funeral procession, keep my hands outside the coffin to show the world I'm going empty handed. I'm not taking a penny with me. The only regret I have is in pursuit of money, I could not help anyone with my money or good deeds. So follow your heart and make sure things near you have a true value. Appreciate every second of your life. This is what the businessman wrote in his note. This story is self-explanatory. Truly, time is the most important thing in our life because without time, life ends. Wishing you a great time ahead. Jai Mahatma.